Hello everyone, it's Saturday so time for a dinosaur fossil. This one is my newest purchase and I know it doesn't look too impressive but it is pretty rare. This is a partial Carcharodontosaurid tooth from the Gres Superiors formation from Laos. These don't come up for sale very often so I'm very pleased to have it. I obtained it in a trade. It's a nice chunky tooth but unfortunately it has the tip missing. But even without the tip, this tooth is almost an inch long, so it would have been from a pretty large predator. The tooth is laterally compressed with serrated edges just being visible, distinguishing it as a xiphodont theropod tooth, notably different from the cone-shaped teeth with striations that are found there belonging to ichthyovenator. In this image here, you can see the two teeth compared to each other and how different they are. Sadly, many of the teeth found in Laos are damaged. The matrix there is very, very hard and teeth are often in poor condition or get damaged upon extraction. As well as this partial tooth, I have another small piece of the tooth shown here. Other than Ichthyovenator, there aren't any large theropods described from Gress superiors, but that formation is equivalent to Thailand's Kok Kroat formation. So to identify this tooth, we look to the Kok Kroat formation and see that the only large theropod with this type of tooth from there is Siam Raptor. So this tooth is likely from a Siam Raptor species. However, some regional dinosaurs may have slight differences, such as the many species of Cetacosaurus. So this may not be Siam Raptor Suwati, so the correct description would be CF Siam Raptor. CF is used when the exact species can't be confirmed, but there is significant resemblance between it and a known species. This is likely a species of Siam Raptor, so it can be labelled as CF Siam Raptor. Now, despite its name, Siam Raptor is not a raptor. It's a Carcharodontosaurid. Not much is actually known about it since the holotype was known from only partial remains. But it is estimated to have had a length of 26 feet and would have been the alpha predator of its time and area. As a Carcharodontosaurid, it would have been cousins to more famous dinosaurs such as the Carcharodontosaurus from, Mor from Morocco, Giganotosaurus and Acrocamphosaurus. It would also have been a cousin of another Carcharodontosaurid discovered recently in Argentina, Moraxus gigas, quite a famous um, discovery. The exact size of this species isn't exactly known, but it's estimated to have had a similar size to Acrocamphosaurus. 36 feet in length, dominating our friend the Siam Raptor and coming close to that of T Rex. Siam Raptor, though, was smaller at 26 feet, but it was still the alpha predator of its area. In Gress Superiors, the other theropod, as mentioned, is Ichthyovenator, a fish eating dinosaur, which I will do a video on at a later date. Other dinosaurs known from there are the sauropod. Tangviosaurus, an iguanodontid called Manchurosaurus, and there have been remains found from a small undescribed theropod. It is a formation that not much is known about. Pricing? I actually can't say. I obtained this in a trade and the teeth are very rare and don't come onto the market, so there isn't really a price which I can say, yes, pay that for it. I would say a full one would carry a hefty price tag. A partial one like this would of course be cheaper. So, so that's it for Siam Raptor. I hope you liked the video and I will have another dinosaur next week. Thanks for watching and take care everyone.